To determine the correct chain required for a pitol tong, the tong itself should first be identified. The type of tong is cast into the handle and jaw of the tong. Drill pipe tongs will start with the letter D. H indicates handle. 2344 indicates tong size, and C12 indicates type and length of handle. Clevis, 12 inch. D indicates drill pipe tong, J indicates jaw, and again 2344 is the tong size. Bull tong parts will begin with the letter L, buck up tong parts with the letter B, and machine tong parts with the letter M. Knowing the chain combination of an existing chain is also helpful in determining the proper chain. For reference, a chain identification guide is available in the GearWrench catalog as well as on the website. The chain combination indicates the width of the chain in links. GearWrench tongs are equipped with one of five possible chain combinations. 2-2 chain is four links wide, 3-4 chain is seven links wide, 4-4 chain is eight links wide, 4-5 chain is 9 links wide, 5-6 chain is 11 links wide. Knowing which latching component is on the end of the chain is another helpful identifying feature. Petal chains are latched by one of three methods. A chain screw with adjusting nut, a chain hook, or the chain pins that extend out on each side of the chain. If the chain has a chain hook latching component, knowing the length of the hook is necessary, as there are three different lengths for most hooks. This length can be determined by the part number imprinted on the side of the hook. A part number ending in 2625 indicates a 2 and 5 8 inch hook. 4250 indicates a 4 and a quarter inch hook. 6250 indicates a 6 and a quarter inch hook. If the number is no longer legible, take a measurement from the center of the pinhole to the top of the radius in the latching area. The length of a pitol chain is determined by the number of links. Starting at one end, count the number of chain valleys in the chain. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. This would be a nine link chain. Always be sure to include the valleys of the links connected to master links or latching components. The last detail required in selecting the right chain for a tong or replacement is the maximum OD being worked. This tong has been identified as a DA2344 C12 based on the part numbers found on the handle and jaw. For reference, a chain selection guide is available in the GearWrench catalog as well as on the website. If the maximum OD to be worked with this tong is 4 inches, chain part number 151-4509D will be needed. This part number indicates a 4-5 link combination, 9 link long chain, suitable for working 3 and 5 8 inch to 4 and 3 8 inch OD on a DA2344 C12 drill pipe tong. The chain is assembled in chain sections with splice bolts and nuts. This allows for removal of link sections to shorten the chain and work smaller OD sizes, or add link sections to work larger OD sizes. The most common section is a two link section. If adding link sections, a splice bolt and nut will be needed for each section.